What's going on guys? So I want to talk a little bit about storage on uh, quarters. So uh, for the last couple of months I've been working on this. Actually, I bought this box. A hundred dollars worth of quarters. Or safe box. But this is what I've been working on. Uh, so far all of these rolls right here. All of them. All these rolls are uh, 1964 quarters or you know silver quarters so I have one two three four four and this one is almost complete four four and a half five six and that one's empty but um, from my previous video the proofs are going in here so so far I just need to go ahead and um, fill this one and the rest of this one and I will have completed a box of one hundred dollars face value in silver quarters all of these are full of just silver quarters some of the quarters in here are actually really nice, really nice shape. But um that's one of one of my goals that I've had for the year. Uh last year I actually filled up one of these in half a year. But uh these were my beauties, two rolls of proof, 2004, 16 of each. So um I got a month. I got two months to um two months to fill the rest of that and this one to reach one of my goals for the year again i got the square ones because they fit perfectly in here there's 10 rolls and in the box and um that's it you just stack this box on top of the other box and there you go a hundred dollars um 10 rolls so, uh, wish me luck. I should... Actually, yeah, I'll be done here in a couple of days because I ordered a couple more quarters. Two rolls of quarters that I got for a really good deal. So, um, just thought I'd talk a little bit about the storage. And I I, I was going to get the, the round ones, but the round ones roll around and they don't fit in here correctly. So, um, I bought ten rolls. Uh, just to try it out so in January I'll buy another one of these boxes with 10 tubes and uh, that's another goal for the year besides you know normal eagles and numismatic stuff so well click like leave a comment let me know what you guys think thanks